We're here with UIC head track and field coach Ashley Lucas as the Flames prepare to head to Youngstown State this weekend for the Horizon League Indoor Track and Field Championships. Coach, track and field's a little bit different in a sense of you don't necessarily see a lot of the teams in your conference during the regular season. You've obviously been to Milwaukee a couple mm -hmm. times. You had some people from Oakland at the, at the meet at Notre Dame as well. But, but on the whole, you haven't seen a lot of, uh, a lot of other schools. Right. What's the mindset when you're going up to compete against some people that you haven't necessarily seen uh, this season? Mm -hmm. I mean, I think to me, we kind of preach, you know, it doesn't matter who you're competing against. You're out there to run to win. Um, it's nice to be able to kind of get a gauge on to see what the other schools, what marks they're hitting. And at least with our sport, it's pretty black and white in the fact that you see the times that they're running throughout the year. So it's a little different compared to like cross country where you never know what the cross, like the cross country course is like. With here for a track, a track is a track. So kind of seeing the times you get to kind of rank yourself. Um, so even though we haven't competed against them, we kind of already know where we're stacking up individually um, and as a team. So, but come conference, you know, you're just out there to get as many points as you can individually and as a team. So it doesn't really matter what other teams are out there. We're just going out to win that event. One of the things you've talked about quite a bit about this year is kind of growing confidence from week to week within the, you know, the, the overall team and the mm -hmm. student athletes themselves. How would you assess where that's at right now heading into the conference meet this weekend? Yeah, they all seem pretty like calm, which actually to me is a sign of confidence. Um, everybody's going to have a little natural nerve. To me as a coach, I'd actually be a little more concerned if they didn't have any nerves because um, having a little bit of nerve shows how much you care. Um, and they definitely are all, when I talk to them, um, just very calm, cool, collected, and ready to compete at conference. Uh, so they're excited. And they're, I think a lot of their confidence is aiding in that because they see the potential that they have to do big things at conference. So I'm really excited for, for the team to see kind of where we stack up on that day. And the team is looking forward to it as well. Two of the groups that have had pretty strong seasons would be the, the women's distance runners and the, and the male throwers. We've mm -hmm. seen a lot of consistency out of those groups. Overall, you know, what are your expectations for, for those two groups and, and who might step up uh, among them this weekend? Yeah, I mean, I think that this was the first year that we haven't totally utilized the throws room. We've been throwing a little bit more on the turf, which I think is aided obviously very well for our throws groups because they've been throwing PRs. Um, so I think just giving them a little bit more freedom in their throws and not having to be as confined has helped them tremendously. Um, and I think with both Lath and Luke being seniors, they're really looking to go big. Uh, in both the shot put and the weight throw. So top five for them is definitely realistic in their events. Um, and then the women's distance, I mean, they've come leaps and bounds from, from last year. Um, so we're looking just even on that side to kind of triple what we scored last year. Last year we kind of were scraping at the bottom of the barrel to get some points with them. Uh, the women's 5K right now, we've got uh, four girls sitting in the top nine, which is super exciting. Um, and if you look at it, we're kind of the only school that has that kind of pack up there so it's going to be good for them to be able to work together during that race and hopefully score some big points there um their confidence has just been super impressive and the prs that they have been running have been super impressive so they're they're riding the high and they're they're really excited to get at it this weekend finish this sentence or this thought this will be a successful weekend for the flames if if we go out and attack and execute the plan like we should